with the latest update we have variable fonts now within Brizzy and that will be for pro versions because you will need to upload the variable font but let me show you what is a variable font I have this text here and if I go to the T4 topography and under weight it says variable you will see now we have a slider and I can slide it all the way from a hundred up to 700 depending on the variable font thickness it can go up to 900 or whatever the settings may be this makes it great no need to worry about weight and you have all this flexibility right at your fingertips how do we work with variable fonts let's do one from scratch in case you don't know what a variable font is I'll go to fonts.google.com and this is where you can get variable fonts for free important select here under technology the option for variable now you will see your favorites like Montserrat they all appear here let's choose one like this over here Rubik select it and all you need to do is click on download the family or download family open file and this is a zip file and you will see within the immediate structure of the folder you will get the variable font weights now one is italic and this is the normal one let's just stick with this one click hold and drag out of the zip folder I'll put it in downloads and now we have Rubik here go back into Brizzy let's select any text area go to T for topography and select add new font from here if you have pro you can upload so click on upload and then we give it a name or we give it its name click on continue and next you are not going to care about the font weight you will go to the TTF file click on upload and select the font the Rubik open add font and then continue no new font variation added and select done and as you scroll up now you will see it will appear at the top of the font list next to it you will also see this little label that says variable nice indicator and we can select Rubik for the text go to wait and you will see we have the slider this one from 300 to 900 as I've mentioned the weight usually runs for many fonts from a hundred to 900 and that gives you the naming from ultra thin all the way to black variable fonts one of my favorites I'm so happy about this one get playing with it today remember if you have a suggestion for something that you would like to see included in Brizzy the best place to do it is to go to brizzy.io scroll to the bottom of the page and under resources select suggest ideas this is the best one place that I can recommend you put your ideas and you can already see what has been suggested what is in progress what is planned and for those that cannot be implemented variable fonts was one such suggestion and there it is now so go ahead bring your ideas into the fold and check out what other people have also suggested for more updates and other goodies here at Brizzy remember you need to subscribe for that also give this video a like and I'll see you around in the next one